I wanted to try a drink that I've never tried before. I've never tried like an Indian drink. <laughs> yeah, what do you recommend? We like it. Yeah? Uh, we want to try something like popular. Yeah, this is the popular one. It's a thumbs up. Ooh. I mean, yeah, this is the same. Yeah? Uh, same like Coke. Yeah? But thumbs up. Okay, it's let's good. try it. Yeah. We'll see if we get the thumbs up. <laughs> hey guys, and welcome back to our channel. Today I am so excited because I'm gonna share with you my go-to Indian grocery store. And this place is called the Big Bazaar. And here you're gonna find so many Indian spices. And anytime I'm making an Indian cooking video, I am always going to the Big Bazaar. So I'm gonna show you guys what is inside, but I'm also gonna get the ingredients for my very first vegetarian dosa. I am not sure how it's gonna go because I think you need a lot of technique to make a dosa. So you guys have to stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button, hit the bell, hit the like, and it is time to show you guys my go-to Indian grocery store. Let's go. We came on a kind of afternoon where there's not too many people here, but on the weekday, this place is packed. They got everything. So I'm gonna take you down this aisle where we see all of the vegetables. And we need a basket, but let's get a basket. So like I said at the beginning, I'm gonna get the ingredients to make my very first dosa. So we're gonna start by going over here check out all of these ingredients. Now, these are, you guys can let me know in the comments, but these are all from India. Lots of spices down here. And again, when you, as soon as you come into this grocery store, you just smell those beautiful spices. The other thing, guys, about this place is they got really nice homemade samosas at the cashier so we're gonna grab a couple of those so stay tuned we have not tried actually their samosas at this uh, grocery store oh so here we are we are looking for the pan to make the dosa in we don't have a pan so I called the owner the owners here are super nice they said they have a dosa pan and it might be right here <laughs> let's see I saw a few videos and it's supposed to look kind of flat like this. Here, I'll show you guys. Ooh, that looks like a good size. Very thin, but we're gonna ask one of the workers here if he recommends this as the best uh, dosa pan. One this one, good one, yes. One. This one, good one. Are we gonna get a tasty dosa from that pan? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I like that pan. You guys, maybe um, we'll get like one of these. And it's non-stick too. Okay. Okay guys, I think we're gonna go with this one. It says granite finish. Is this an Indian brand? Oh, nice. Okay, I think it's gonna go into the basket. What do you think, Alfonso? Yes. It looks good? You like it? Yeah. Okay, he likes it. We'll put it in. Okay, we're going to continue. Now, for the dosa, we need dosa batter, but we also need the filling. So I know we need a lot of potatoes. And while I'm here, because you can't get this anywhere else, I'm gonna get some curry leaves. I don't actually see, I thought these were curry leaves, but these are menthi. Oh, wow. I only seen the dry um, one of this. I've never seen what it actually looks like. Cool. Okay, let's continue looking for our ingredients. So on my search for the filling, I came across this interesting looking vegetable fruit. I don't know what it is. and. The funny thing about this store is that there's 
there's like no signs to show what it is. It's kind of like a, like, like a, a lot of locals come here, so they obviously know what these are, but I have no idea what this is. You guys can let me know. It looks very interesting. Um, there's also one more thing I want to show you. Are you ready? Hold on. I need two arms for this. What is this? <laughs> is this a huge squash? This is so big. Alfonso, come here. Look how big this squash is. Oh. It's like half the size of you. No, I'm bigger than you. Yeah. Okay, he says he's bigger than it. <laughs> Alfonso's going to be six years old in like five days. Are you excited to be six years old? Yeah. He's excited. <laughs> Let's continue looking for our ingredients. Okay, guys, I found the potatoes. And just so you can see on this side, this whole wall is lentils. So many different kinds of lentils, and I've only touched a few. You guys can literally get everything here, and more. There is so much to try. Okay, we're gonna get some potatoes. This is gonna go inside my dosa. And I have some ingredients at home, so I'm not gonna get all of it, but coming up over here, we have the dosa batter homemade come take a look you can see the paneer cheese is over here there's a yo oh wow a mint flavored yogurt drink that's interesting i've seen a yogurt drink in um persian food okay here we go dosa batter stone ground fresh home style you guys know this brand so we are going to try it. I guess you need to shake it up because I looked online and to make this batter from scratch, it takes a long time, like a lot of process, a lot of hours. So we're just gonna get it like this. Okay, and I also wanna show you guys, this store is packed. Look at all of the rice. They got rice everywhere. Tons of stuff here. Come look this way. Oh, look, they even have the dosa here, um, oh, they have idli, pakora, <laughs> lots of mixes, and tons of different, bread. lots of bread. Oh yeah, they do. They have all of the ingredients you would need. Oh, they even have pani puri flour. Wow, right here. Oh. This is great. I love penny puri. I need to do, we need to do another penny puri video because I miss eating it. <laughs> okay, look at all of this rice. So many choices. So many brands I've never even seen before. So the last time we came down this aisle, it was to do our very first Indian snack video. If you guys haven't seen it, go take a look. We tried a lot of snacks from this place and here it is again, yes, tons. Alfonso's favorite when we did the snack video was the plantain chips. This Let's one. see, there's so many different brands of plantain Ooh, chips. This hey. one, there's this one has pepper on it, so oh. maybe not the best for Alfonso. I, this one is the best for me. This one? Yeah. Do you want to try this one? Yeah. Let's show them. This is a different brand than we tried. We tried, I believe, this one called Anada. So, is this one the Anada? yes, we tried this one last time. Yeah. And let's try a different one. Oh, so should we go with this one? Yes, we should go with this one. You could put it in the basket. Yeah, this is my snack. <laughs> Guys, no take cookie. a look. Look at all of the snacks here. Cookies. They have some like, I think this is like lentils that are spiced, which actually Ooh. sounds super tasty. Um, masala peanuts. That. We haven't tried that one. So many different oh, snacks, guys. Oh, different. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite snack this is. I'm curious. A There's a different one. <laughs> so as we continue down this like selection of snacks, over here you can find some frozen stuff. You can find the samosas. Um, you can find seek kebab here too. And the same with this aisle. Now this is the tea aisle. I always try to make a really good 
um, chai, but I haven't been successful yet. <laughs> you guys still have let me know in the comments below how to make a super good chai. I need to go back and review because big Alfonso likes chai, right Alfonso? <laughs> yes. Another aisle that I always visit is this one where it has the nuts and raisins and dates. And this is what I really love about Indian food. Like my favorite uh, curry is with the cashews and uh, what was it, raisins? So tasty. Love it, that's what makes it that sweet flavor instead of uh, the processed sugars. And then over here, you have the already made Pani Puri. I did a Pani Puri video, you guys gotta go check that out. It wasn't done like this, but they like puffed up in a bunch of oil. Really cool. And I believe these are from India too. These buns, you guys have let me know in the comments that when I made, I think it was Pav Baji, something like that, like a street food, these buns, they have flour that's completely different in India than in America. So I think these are the real deal. They're very, very soft. And I'm already getting hungry now, talking about all this. <laughs> now, this aisle, always visit. Look at all of the spices in this aisle, guys. This is home. This is where you smell all of that beautiful aroma of Indian food. It is so beautiful. Take a look. You have all different kinds of spices, curries, you name it, you find it in this aisle. I'm actually a little bit happy that we came on a slow time because you can't really fit too many people in the aisle. And again, this place is so busy when you come during the day. Um, lots of different things. I believe we had something like this. We did a homemade pani puri and it was like this. Yeah, and we put these in oil and they puffed up really fast. Yeah, and it was really, really exciting for us. <laughs> and they were super tasty. So you can find anything here. They even have this. It's pani puri, but, oops, sorry, baby. <laughs> Golgapa. So maybe different place, different taste. Oh, wait, there's different new stuff inside. Oh yeah, Alfonso says there's different like spices inside of here. Yummy. So many different kinds of spices, guys. We're gonna continue through this amazing store. So over here, they have some chutneys already made, and we have tried their mint chutney. It was really good. We're gonna do coconut because of the dosa. The recipe I'm following has coconut and sambar. Take a look. So the brand Deep Chutney Coconut. I love coconut chutney, so I have not tried this one. I'm hoping it's really tasty. So let's put it in. Let's continue. Take a look at this aisle, guys. More and more. <gasps> the ghee. The ghee is so good. I love ghee, okay? And I'm just super in love with it. It's so tasty. And then you guys were telling me that it's actually healthy. And then I did research on it. And yes, it is true. It is healthier than the other butters. Um, yeah, so I probably will need to get one of these because I want my dosa to taste extremely delicious. <laughs> so let's get one. I'm leaning more towards this brand. I don't know what you guys think about that. I'm gonna go for it. Let's just take a small one. And as we continue, there was one thing you guys told me that has such a distinct flavor and it's right here. Whoa. Mustard seed oil. I'm not sure if this is north, south, or all of India that you guys use this oil. You guys can let me know. But some of you were saying it has a very like distinct flavor. Sometimes you won't like it. I haven't used it but when I try uh, food at the restaurants Indian food and then I'm like oh it has this interesting flavor you guys are like it's the mustard seed oil so but we're not gonna use that today what else do they have I think as you can see that was 
some South Indian here. Ooh, they have biryani masala. We love biryani. Guys, stay tuned. Make sure you hit that subscribe button because we are going to have some biryani later. And yeah, you guys gotta see my reaction to that. <laughs> and here is the dessert aisle, your guys' favorite. <laughs> so here you can find so many Indian desserts. We've only tried a few, but take a look. So let's start at the top. They have, we have not tried this. Mawa cow burki. Hmm. Delicious milk based confection. I have no idea what that is. Maybe it's rice? And then they have different flavors. Cashew based, a traditional Indian dessert. I think last time we went through this aisle, the owner of the, rest, uh, the, owner of the grocery store was saying that these are found in all of India, not just north, south. So, gulab jamun, you guys have been telling us, you need to have gulab jamun with uh, vanilla ice cream. It is the best. <laughs> I'm sure it's Alfonso's favorite. We've had this one before. This is with that um, edible silver uh, thing. I'm not sure what to call it. <laughs> and what else? This one's cool because you can have a taste of everything. What I like about Indian desserts is they're actually not too sweet compared to like the American ones. This looks interesting. Ranguli Ladu. Hmm. It says gram flour, cardamom. Oh, there's almonds, pistachios. Very interesting, guys. You guys can let me know what you think. Maybe we should do a dessert video just for Alfonso to try. <laughs> First time trying. Oh, these are traditional drinks. We haven't actually touched the drink aisle. We usually have um, Alfonso's favorite. What's your favorite uh, Indian drink? It's the uh, mango, mango lassi. Yeah. You like the mango lassi? Yeah. He's curious to see what's in this. So maybe one day we'll do one of these. Whoa. You guys can let me know. Which one is it? I'm not sure. Is that one? This one has some interesting chia seeds in it. Basil seed drink. Whoa. Never seen that before. Also, this looks interesting. Masala Jera? What is this? Yeah, it kind of does. Kind of want to try it. <laughs> And here we have the ice cream. And look at this ice cream that's wrapped up with something around it. This looks really cool. Cake based ice cream with chocolates, fruits, and nuts. This guy says it's, it's really good. <laughs> it must be really good. And he's got the, he's got the wink going on. <laughs> All right, let's continue. Uh, lots of ice cream, guys. For me, we actually don't really do ice cream too much, but this looks very interesting. They have like, I don't know, maybe that's papaya, mango. They got some something at the top here, malai kuya. I gotta work on my pronunciation. <laughs> <laughs> As we continue, you see more and more desserts. Actually, I don't know if those are desserts. Oh, oh gulab? That's Alfonso's favorite. And we finish off with the last aisle. Looks like teas and some sort of like incense or I don't know how to say that, scents. So really beautiful aisle. I'm not too sure about all of it, but, but yeah guys, this pretty much concludes yes. my favorite go-to. Indian store. You guys can let me know what you think. We're going to get these ingredients. Um, and then at the front, they have their own homemade samosas. We're going to try them for the very first time. So yeah, we're excited. Yeah, I, I'll try one of each. That sounds really good. So they have chicken samosa and they have vegetable samosa. We're going to try one of each. And yeah, we're going to get the ingredients. 
So the owner recommends we get a different pan. He was suggesting that we get this one. It's better quality and um, it's gonna, it has lifetime warranty and I don't know if that matters. It, it's very, very good though. It's solid. So we're gonna exchange that. <laughs> They're just gonna grab a thing to go, to go get it. Okay, we got the pan. Okay guys, I got all of my stuff. I got my nice pan. I'm really excited about this. And then I got two of the samosas. One vegetable, one chicken, and there's some sort of a tomato chutney spicy that he recommended I try with it. So, and we got the thumbs up. For the first time, we're gonna try it. Alfonso's excited. Yeah, it's a drink. It's the most popular one, actually. So I'm just gonna put this down maybe here. And we'll put that here. So we are going to try. Alfonso's gonna try it too. Um, take a look at this. Are you excited? Yeah. One of our favorites, samosa. Ooh, crispy. That looks really good. I'm not sure which one this is. It could be vegetable, it could be chicken. Let's just try it on its own. Mm. Oh my gosh, it's chicken. It is so good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, Alfonso, this is really good. Um, every time we go to restaurants, usually it's only vegetable samosa. When I have the chicken samosa, it is so flavorful. Not too spicy at all, yeah. I'll face the camera. This is chicken samosa. Ooh, he went for the double bite. It's good. It's good, right? Yeah. It is super, super tasty. Um, here, Alfonso, do you want to hold this one while I try the other one? You want me to hold it? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it here. No, I'm gonna put it in the bag because I don't want to drop that. I am super hungry. The next is a vegetable samosa, and we got some sort of a spicy tomato chutney. Look at how crispy the samosa is. Super crispy. I made my own homemade samosas. They are not as tasty as these ones, but go check it out if you haven't seen it. Okay, ready? Is it spicy? Mmm, <laughs> my gosh. That's how you say it. Mmm. Mmm. Spicy, spicy. Ooh, this is really good. That's right. This one's a little spicy. It, a I little. See, I hold that. Not that much. <laughs> Here. This has so much flavor. Can you tell with the color? <laughs> we need a little bit of this um, chutney over here to try with it. Mm, let me put this. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is so tasty, guys. Oh, look at that. It's more like tomato-y. Onions, cilantro. I'm going to go for the corner bit. My favorite is the corner bit. Oh my God, that is so good. Mm. There's like real curry leaves in here and it is just adding such a kick of flavor. Not too spicy for me at all. I actually like spicy. We don't normally order spicy so um, Alfonso can have some food but if it was up to me, I would get spicy. Um, I found my mm. I found it. Mm. It's cold. Mm -hmm. Alfonso found the dessert. Really, really good, guys. No, the, the, we got to try the thumbs up. No, the one with the people. Oh, I know, the silver one. Yeah. Okay, we got to try the... Let me pl place this down for a second. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And save this for... Now we got to try the thumbs up, the most popular Indian drink. Oh, yeah. We have not done any Indian drinks. I haven't tried any other than the... Um, oh. No, um, the mango lassi. That's like our thing. But, are you ready? Thumbs up. There's even a thumbs up. It says 75 years of India's independence. Thumbs up. Har hath to fan. Okay. This is Coke. Hold on, there's an ice on it. Coca Cola. I don't want it to. Ooh, these, these, can, these Indian cans are thick. Not like the American ones. 
Okay. Yeah. Thumbs up. Let me see if I give you the thumbs up. Stop. Oh. Yeah. 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 Uh, my, oh. My turn. <laughs> it gets the thumbs up. <laughs> it's, turn. it's actually really refreshing. <laughs> so, Alfonso doesn't drink pop often, ever actually. Um. So yeah. This is his first time ever trying um, Coke or pop. I, I did. Okay, here. It's good. <laughs> it's good? But did it get the thumbs up? Thumbs up. It got double thumbs up. That just added a boost of energy for Alfonso, guys. So that pretty much wraps up this video, guys. My go-to Indian uh, grocery store. You can find everything in here. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Later on the other videos, I'm gonna show you my first time making a vegetarian dosa, guys. So hit that subscribe button, hit the like, hit the bell. And on that note, just keep on dancing. Keep on dancing. <laughs>